I'd just like to show uh, running Windows 3.1 on Microsoft Virtual PC. I've installed the Microsoft Virtual PC software, which is free. You can download it from Microsoft. I set up a new virtual PC and called it Windows 3.1. Basically, it boots your computer and I had installed DOS just to make this easier. I don't know for sure if I need it or not. Take the Windows 3.1 disk out, continue the boot. There's MS-DOS booting in a window. It actually creates a virtual hard drive. Now I'm putting my Windows 3.1 install disk in the A drive. Going to the A drive and running setup. Installing DOS was basically the same thing except for you could boot off of the floppy, so I just put the floppy in before I started the virtual machine. And now I'm going to simply start the setup. It says to run Express Setup, that should be fine. And I'm not sure how this is going to turn out since I have not yet done Windows 3.1 on the virtual PC 2007 for Vista. I am now inserting Microsoft Windows for Workgroups Disk 2 and pressing Enter. Windows is now attempting to detect what network card I have on my computer. I can now type in my Windows 3.1 name and product number. Well, I couldn't find the product number. I thought it was like XP or 95 where it forced you to do that, but I just uh, went ahead with it and it seems to be installing just fine without the number. Here's to changes. Disk 4. Disk 5. And disk 6. Now I remember why I like the CDs. And now we're at some setups here asking for a printer and I'm just gonna go ahead and put no printer attached. Install for a network. Continue. Ooh, there comes our Windows 3.1. Uh, we want the DOS editor. Okay. We can get a tutorial on Windows if we would like to. But I'll skip the tutorial. And let's restart the computer. Remove the last disk number 5 of Windows X 
and it looks like I will have to manually load our windows. Remember the old WIN? Wow, that nice and fast there. Uh, let's see. Look at our old games. Here's a solitaire game. Exit. Close. Applications. Close. Uh, let's go into the control panel. Sound. I don't think the sound is working. But Windows 3.1 is definitely working. Goodbye.